Alright, hi people, it's Shrix here, and I'm here to do my unboxing of the Naruto Triple Feature 3 movie set of the uh, three original series Naruto movies. Ninja Clash in the Land of Snow, Legend of the Stone of Galel. Galil? Jello? I have no idea how to pronounce that. Uh, yet, at least. Um, and Guardians of the Crescent Moon Kingdom uh, from Viz Media. And it, it's on pre-order on sites like Amazon, and I assume Right Stuff, but I'm not sure about Right Stuff, because I don't use that site primarily. Um, but you can easily go to Walmart and get this. I got this from my Walmart uh, the night before I'm recording this. Uh, the night before I recorded this, so uh, it's not that hard to get it from Walmart. Uh... So yeah, and it only costs like 15 bucks on at Walmart, whereas on Amazon, it costs like somewhere around 17 to 18 bucks. So, you're getting a deal. So yeah, for three movies, it's not that bad. Uh, these are not Blu-rays, these are only DVDs. Viz Media, for some reason, has not re-released these movies on Blu-ray yet, even though that I believe they put the HD versions of, the move, of these movies on iTunes. So, obviously they have the HD masters, so why don't they put these on iTunes. Doesn't make much sense. And it does not come with a slip cover as far as I know, so don't expect to get one. So yeah, uh, it's sort of like in the style of the original Naruto series DVDs. If you've seen my unboxings of Volume 1 and Volume 2 of Season 1 for Naruto, you know what I'm talking about. So yeah, so here's the spine. Naruto Triple Feature, three full-length movies. Uh, three different pictures of Naruto from the front here. So yeah, and on the back it lists the movies. The it gives you descriptions of the movies' plots. Uh, the they all have English 5.1 with the Japanese stereo and English subtitles, and then it gives you the length of time. They're approximately 95 minutes each. Uh, special features for the first one is special footage hidden leaf. Village Grand Sports Festival, original Japanese mo movie trailers, and then just a whole bunch of legal stuff for uh, Legend of the Stone of Galal. Uh, special features included director's audio commentary, an on-screen Naruto guide, and for Guardians of the Crescent Moon Kingdom, you get an audio commentary. So yeah, and one thing I don't get is, is Clash in the Land of Snow, uh, or Ninja Clash in the Land of Snow, uh, 16 by 9 I assume it is because it's a movie, but these say it's 16 by 9 This doesn't say what aspect ratio it's in. Seriously. Look at this. It's a 16 by 9 anamorphic video, which means widescreen. And here it doesn't say anything. It doesn't say 16 by 9 It doesn't say 16 eight, 4 by 3 It doesn't say anything. I assume it's widescreen, and I'll let you guys know in the description as soon as I watch the first movie. Uh... So yeah, but if anyone does know before I can find out for myself, leave it in the comments. And yeah, but if you don't get back to me before I put it in the description, um, there you go. So yeah. So yeah, so you get a whole bunch of legal stuff here, Viz Media, Warner Bros, Shonen Jump. Uh, it's, they're all Region 1, and it's approximately 285 minutes worth of movies and TV 14. So yeah. On the inside, it's basically just basic, uh, no inside artwork. The case is just a plain black case uh, with these. Uh, the first movie on one disc, second movie on another, third movie on another. I assume that these are re-releases of the original discs, like uh, Funimation tends to do with like shows like Toriko and One Piece and Dragon Ball. Well, sort of Dragon Ball, but they. What I mean is that for the collection sets of One Piece, they take the discs uh, from the Voyage sets. Uh, they basically take the same discs because they're they all say the Voyage set that they belong to rather than collection, and then they redress them in new disc art, and it's basically the same content that you get with the Voyage sets. So yeah, I highly recommend this. If you haven't gotten the Naruto movies yet, uh, like I haven't, uh, in Viz Media, I wish you would re-release all the movies you have not released yet on Blu-ray on Blu-ray. This is another thing I just wanted to show this off. I got 
It's it's also available at Walmart for five bucks. A uh, reprinting of the graphic novel uh, Captain America: Winter Soldier to coincide with the release of the Captain America: Winter Soldier Blu-ray and DVD uh, combo packs and stuff like that. So yeah, and you get a free digital issue of Captain America inside. Uh, that's uh, there was a code right here, but I don't know the way I think I ripped it off. Uh, the code was partially scratched off, so I'm not sure. Um, I'm not sure what the code is. So, so here's the back, and just gonna flip through the pages. So yeah, nicely sized pages, and all that. So yeah, so yeah, uh, comment and subscribe. Go on my channel. Go on my second channel. Follow on Twitter. Link is in the description. Uh, I'd recommend this and this too. I will read this soon. So yeah, uh, I'll talk to you guys more later.